What's up, world? Goofy Foot George here. Today, we are taking a closer look at the, it's the Viore Banks Board Short slash Gym Short. Whoa! You mean it does both? Yeah, bro, Gym Short and Board Short. Ew! Guys, I am so stoked on Viore's Banks Board Short. These things are sick. Now, the material here is a 44% recycled polyester. Way to go, Viore, for using sustainable products in your board shorts. These are sick. Very cool. Very, very cool. It's great. It's really great. Also, 44% regular polyester and 12% spandex, which gives these board shorts their epic stretch. That's what makes them so great for, say, the gym or just everyday active use. The fabric here is really nice. I love it. It feels durable. It's also very stretchy and it moves with you really well. The weight of this board short is a little heavy, I would consider. It weighs roughly 7.5 ounces. Now again, we're talking ounces here, so this isn't a lot, but compared to a normal pair of board shorts, this is roughly about two ounces heavier than say the uh, Equator board short, which you can check the review for that. Um, so these are a little bit heavier than a normal board short, and I think a lot of that weight is coming from the waistband in this particular pair. Um, so it does have an elastic, stretchy waistband. Great, super comfortable. Dads around the world are gonna love these because they just slide right on. But the material that they used in here, it's soft and stretchy and nice and comfy, but it's also a little bit heavy, so it is adding more weight. Now, comparatively, we have a board short right here. This is made by a brand that I don't think is around anymore. It's called Depactus. And you can see this has an elastic waistband too, but it's a very water appropriate material. I still think these are super comfortable, but it's also incredibly lightweight. The Depactus board short weighs in at 5.7 ounces, whereas this is 7.5. Now, granted, that one doesn't have nearly as many pockets, so there is a difference there. There also is no fly to this board short, which is really nice. So again, you just slide right into them. And they've got the little tie laces here. The little metal end caps are a bit of a mm, problem for me. They kind of bug me a little bit. They're really nice, I like them a lot. But let's say if you're doing jump ropes, that tends to make them want to flop up and down if you don't have your laces tied. And also for me, if I'm surfing, I'm just not a huge fan of having metal parts rubbing against my surfboard. It's just a no brainer for me. But overall, the board short itself is really nice. I like wearing them a lot. Specifically here at the gym, I think they're killer. The great thing is, is I can wear them after the gym to work all day and they have all the pockets that I need. That's what's really sick about these is they have tons of pockets. Thank you, Surf Gods, for pockets. So we've got two side pockets right here. We also have a back zipper pocket and even a tiny little storage compartment right here. Now you might be wondering, hmm, what can I fit in that pocket? <laughs> you could put your stash in there, George. Yeah, or we could definitely put a key, uh, you could put your cash, your credit card, whatever you need to keep with you when you're at the gym, right here in this tiny little pocket. I will say I wish it had a little wax comb hoop there to attach the key to as well and hold it in tight. But overall, other than that, I absolutely love it. Here is the fit and feel of the Viore Banks board short. As you can see, they slide on just like a normal gym short. But once you tie those laces tight, they do give a supreme hold. So you definitely can wear these surfing. Now, I really like the two big side pockets here on the Banks board short and also the little zipper pocket here that keeps credit cards, IDs, and cash. This is clutch for working out or going to the beach because it's got the zipper pocket, so you don't have to worry about it falling out. Now on the back side here, we also have a very nice back zipper pocket with plenty of storage for your wallet or anything else you might need to put back there. These are board shorts that I'll be wearing, definitely stand up paddle boarding. I'll probably wear them surfing, definitely to the gym. I really like them for that. And just overall everyday use, I think they're really great for. For the fit and size, I normally wear a size 30 and these are size small. Now you can see on the outline of the board short, it, it is a bit more rounded than other board shorts I've reviewed. That's simply a result of the elastic waistband and it's kind of the nature of the beast. But I think Viore has done a good job of making sure that these do have a slim fit. Again, I really like them for everyday use and I can't wait to get more colors like plain black in this board short because they're just so sick. In general, this board short is sick. I love them. Again, they're an all-arounder for sure. A great everyday short. I would give these a 9 out of 10 because they just have across-the-board functionality. 
Again, the only thing I would change is I do wish that waistband was a little bit lighter weight so that overall the board short could be lighter too. Guys, if you like today's review, go ahead and give me a big thumbs up. Also, feel free to let me know if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, and subscribe to my channel if you're new to my page. Also, you can follow me on Instagram for GoofyFootGeorge and my website, GoofyFootGeorge.com, where you'll find the full in-depth review of this board short as well. Feel free to let me know if you need anything as always guys and don't forget who's awesome you're awesome thank you for watching